Welcome back everyone to today's video. Today is going to be a banger. I'm talking about something that is extremely important in videography. Uh, arguably 50% of video is the audio. Audio is very, very important. It's a huge, huge part of video and something that almost every videographer will need is a recorder. This is the Tascam dr 5 budget recorder. It does not have some of the fancy features of some of the more expensive recorders, uh, but it records fantastic audio and we're going to get into some of that today. Okay, so the first thing we're going to be talking about with this recorder is the most obvious thing to talk about with any recorder and that is the record quality. So we're going to be talking about the most important aspect of a recorder like this and that is the audio quality. So you see at the top right here it has two different mics. Uh, so it's not just one mic. So you kind of got like a 3D sound aspect if you want to use that. And I'm just going to switch to this audio shortly and show you what this sounds like. So a sweet feature about this, doesn't have the most features, but a sweet feature is that you can plug a pair of headphones into it. You can hear what this thing is hearing, which is super important if you're like plugging into a sound system or something like that. You can actually, it's in your ears, you're hearing it, rather than just looking at the levels uh, on the display, which it also has, uh, but it's a lot better to just hear it. You can just kind of feel it out a lot better like that. So there is a line out right here. That's where you plug your headphones into. It's going to power up this recorder and then as soon as I press record one time that will bring up the levels that it's hearing as well as uh, then you can hear the sound in here and then when you press record again that's when I'll actually start uh, your recording file. So if we press record once we can see the amount of record time that we have left down right here. 3 hours 22 minutes and 47 seconds. The format is 16 bit. 44.1K stereo. We are gonna jump into a little bit of an audio test right now. So I'm just going to start recording on this. Put on these headphones so that I can actually hear what you're hearing. And as soon as I press record the second time, that is when I'll actually start the recording file. Okay, so now we have switched over to the recorder. As you can see, the audio has changed like a lot uh, from my shotgun mic. Like I had talked about a little bit before, uh, there are two mics right here. So if you're wearing like headphones right now, uh, as I talk in this one, I'm talking in your right ear. As I'm talking in this one, I'm talking in your left ear. So you have kind of like this 3D sound aspect. Now this thing doesn't come with a windscreen, so you're picking up a little bit of like that airy noise of me talking. So I'm just going to bop on a windscreen right here. For when I'm talking, it's going to make it sound so much better. This thing does have a little screw-in hole in the bottom uh, if you want to set it on something like this. Alright, so I have this set on now. I'm just going to pop on this windscreen. This is not something that comes with the recorder. This is just something I have to pop on here to eliminate some of that wind noise. So now that the windscreen is on, the audio has improved even significantly more. So if this is a recorder that you're looking to buy, I totally recommend getting a windscreen. It's a thousand times worth your money to just buy a windscreen. It's going to improve your audio tenfold. So this honestly is not a bad podcast setup. Podcasts are blowing up right now. Maybe you're starting a podcast and you're looking at this recorder because you want to start a podcast. So I've briefly mentioned this already, but just I'm, I'm going to get these things off. I've already talked about this some already, but just the price of this thing is just phenomenal. You can spend hundreds of dollars on a recorder, and yeah, you'll get some more features, possibly some better sound quality, but for so much of what people are doing, they don't actually need a few hundred dollar recorder. And honestly, it's not like you're buying a, a bottom of the line recorder that's going to give you bad audio. I mean, you're hearing this audio for yourself. I think it sounds fantastic. Drop a comment down below on what you think of it. All right, so moving on to features. Uh, the features are a little bit limited on this recorder. You won't have the XLR ports, like the, the big uh, like three prolong audio, although there is a workaround. And the workaround is this cable. This is an XLR to 3.5, and this recorder does have a 3.5 millimeter jack uh, for any external mics you want to plug into or if you want to plug into a sound system, it's going to have to be through a 3.5 millimeter, does not have the XLR port. So that is something you're going to get with a more expensive recorder. So if that's a big deal to you, that will be an advantage of going with the more expensive recorder. So this uses micro SD, comes with a four gigabyte uh, micro SD card, which will give you like three plus hours of recording, depending on quality you're recording in. It also has a USB plug-in right here on the side if you want to plug into your computer. If you don't have a micro SD converter or micro SD card, slot you can plug in through USB that's very handy so a few circumstances you would not want to buy this recorder in is if the XLR plug is a really big deal to you and you don't want to use a converter um, also if you need like top of the line audio that's not what this is this is really really solid audio but if you're someone like me who just needs really good audio this is a fantastic option because you're not spending hundreds of dollars on it it's small it's very portable very very impressive sound quality coming out of this thing I really, really like it. I would 1000% recommend it to you. If you're someone like me who doesn't need like the best, best audio, but just wants really good crisp audio, it's fantastic for podcasts. If you're getting into podcasts, honestly, 
this is a great option um, although there are tons of other great options out there so you can adjust both the volume that's going into your headphones and like the actual like intake level I can just turn up the input level and as you can see the audio is a lot worse but my volume is staying loud and then I can just turn it back down as I bring it closer to me and then more as I'm like actually speaking into it, the audio gets significantly better as we turn that input down and as we get closer to the mic. So if you are farther away, you can turn that up. That's really nice. As well as you can adjust the volume that's going into your headphones. So yeah, guys, that is a very brief video on this sweet little recorder at a very, very good price. Totally recommend it to you guys. It is absolutely awesome. Thank you everybody so much for watching. If you haven't subscribed already, go down there. If you have, thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys subscribing, watching the video. It's absolutely awesome. Thank you, everyone, so much. I will see you all next week. But not really just... And... No. <coughs> Gracious. Rather than... Rather than just... Rather... Rather than just... Rather than... The, rather than you... And then as... And as soon as I... And as, and as soon as I and as soon as I and as soon as I press record the second time, okay, like my and the workaround is crap. Oh, what a cool boy!